Now let us get started with this particular case study. In this case study, we will try to apply all the aspects that we have learned so far pertaining to financial modeling. This case study is for valuation of a company called M Yam Foods Limited, which is an operator of a chain of pizza restaurants. We have been provided the company's financial statements for the year ending 2012. We have been given its income statement, balance sheet and cash flow. We would assume that 2012 was the last reported financial year and we'll work based on that. We've also been given certain operating details of the company including the number of stores they had, average number of stores, year ending number of stores and the company's expansion plans. We've also been given the company's performance expectations in terms of how much the sales is likely to grow and how the cost is expected to behave etc. In addition, we have been given certain information about the company's outstanding debt, the key covenants pertaining to debt and in terms of the loans that needs to be repaid, the loans repayment tenure and the ex we have also have certain assumptions pertaining to the exchange rates and the working capital items as well. Of course, we have also have a finally certain assumptions pertaining to the company's that valuation. We'll go through each of these assumptions in detail when necessary as we work along in this particular financial model. But before we proceed further, let us understand one important aspect that in general, if you're working as an analyst or as a consultant, nobody is going to give you these assumptions. These will have to be arrived at after deeply studying the economy, the industry and the company as well. However, in this case, to keep things a little simple, the information has been provided to us ready hand. 